Hello everybody, I am back for the vlog today and um, <clears throat> I finally figured out my uh, most of my schedule for what I'm going to be doing for these vlogs. So this weekend, or actually every weekend, is going to be um, called Review Weekend where I review uh, one manga series on Friday, one movie series on, or movie, on uh, Saturday, and then a book review on Sunday. That's kind of my plan. Um, so, Fridays will be manga reviews for most of the time, except, you know, I only have like 32 series or something to review, so that's like 30 weeks, 32 weeks or whatever, um, of manga reviews, and I'll probably keep buying manga, so I'll still have some things to do, and um, that will also include first impressions videos, will go on Fridays, and um, stuff that I read online, I might put as a review too, because I don't read manga online, but um, if I do, I'll put a review of, of it. So, yeah, so today's Friday, so that means it's a manga review Friday, and today I'll be reviewing Vagabond by Takahiko Inoue. Now, this uh, was requested by Funkflip31 a while ago, um, and I'm sorry it's so late. I have been procrastinating, as you guys know. But um, that's what I'm going to do with the daily vlogs. That's why I'm changing it to reviews. So, for a while. Um, but yeah, I'm going to be reviewing... I'm reviewing Vagabond right now. So, basically, Vagabond is... Um, the... Is loosely based on a novel written by Eiji Yoshikawa. And that novel was called Musashi. And it's basically the fictition, uh, fictional account of the life of Miyamoto Musashi who is the main character in this manga. <clears throat> like, it's, it's just loosely based, so... Um, it's basically about the main character, who's on the cover, Shinman Takezo, who is a legendary swordsman, um, who bec later becomes the legendary swordsman, Musashi Miyamoto. And, um... He, um, in the beginning of the manga, he's just uh, returning from war, from the Battle of Sekigahara, which took place in 1959, uh, or 15, what am I saying, 1590, 1599, and it's like in the beginning of the 1600s, sorry, <laughs> um, but yeah, he's came back from war with his friend, uh, Marahachi, and here's a picture of the main character, that is Takezo, and um, yeah, he is sort of an outcast in his village because he was he is called demon child in the village because of his he's very very tough and um kind of a loner because his he was, didn't really have good terms with his family um so he became a lone goose <laughs> if you want to call it that and um his only friend in life were um he had two friends and that was about it. Um, so he comes back from the from the Battle of Sakigahara, and um, the village wants him out. So that's basically a little little kind of small summary of Volume One. I won't ruin it for you. But um, what I like about this manga is the artwork. It's just really, really, really good. I love the artwork. Um, Sometimes you get colored pages, like you can see right there, one of the main characters. Um, <clears throat> and there's really good action in this manga. Um, it's rated M for mature, so do not get it if you're under the age of 18, because I don't want anyone to get mad at me for recommending a manga that's very, very violent and, you know, M rated. But, um, just keep that in mind. There are sexual references and violence, uh, language, and gore. And here's more color pages. This goes on throughout the manga, by the way, uh, the continuous color pages. But, um, in the... Oh, I'm sorry. forgot to mention. Uh, in the... This is usually published now in the Viz Big Editions. There are currently seven volumes out. Uh, the seventh, seventh volume of the Big Edition just came out. Uh, April 20th. So you can pick that up if you are collecting that series. What's really cool about the big editions is the fact that 
when you line them up, they create a continuous picture, like uh, Dragon Ball manga does, which I can't do because I have the single volumes. And the reason I have the single volumes is because I found them for like five bucks each at Hastings. So really, really good deal. But now I'm stuck with 12 volumes of these. And if I want more, I'm probably going to have to either order them online or sell these and rebuy them in the big editions, which I'm not sure what I'm going to do. I might just buy the big editions, but anyway. Um, so this manga was is really, really good. Uh, there are currently 31 volumes out in Japan. Or 31 volumes out, yeah. And it's ongoing still. It's been ongoing since 2002, or 1998 in Japan and 2002 in America. So it's pretty fairly old, not old, but you know, it's been around for a while, and um, it's still ongoing. But the art is well worth the money, and the story is very good too, and it's more realistic style, uh, like fighting style. Um, <clears throat> but you know, not completely realistic. But that's sort of my review of Vagabond. Um, I would definitely recommend it. It's one of my favorite manga series. So I hope you guys decide to pick up this series if you are um, old enough or if you can read rated M manga. But anyway, so that's my first review for this channel. Um, tomorrow is going to be our movie review. I'm not sure what movie, but um, we'll find out tomorrow, I guess. So I hope you enjoyed this video, and please um, give me suggestions for what my other days of the week can be. Um, I have an idea of maybe doing a tag video Tuesday, maybe. That's one of my other ideas, but it's still, uh, you know, not really um, a set and done deal. But that's my review, so thank you so much for watching. I hope you guys have a great weekend, and I will see you guys tomorrow. It's going to be a review weekend. So um, I'm thinking that Friday is going to be manga reviews, and... Stupid freaking cell phone. <sighs> anyway, Monday will be... No, Saturday. See, it messes me up now. Matahachi. Sorry. That's his name. His friend's name is Matahachi. Um, this is a picture of Takezo. <sighs> One second. I know there are over 30 volumes in the series. I can't remember how many exactly, but I... I don't know if it's ongoing either. I think it is, but no. I don't remember. <sighs> Great job, right? Don't even research before you review something. Anyway, um, so he wants to be, uh, shipment? Ready. Okay.